welcome back to my channel. Look at me, fucking YouTuber. Yes, we're doing this. Okay, so I went to the store. I really like want to drop a lot of F-bombs, but I've been working on like cutting back because I've, they've been excessive, like in excess. I've been in excess of F-bombs lately. So I'm trying to cut back. Anyway, that's not important. I went shopping and as m most of you know, um, I like to spend money the same way I like to live my life, recklessly and irresponsibly. So I went to the store with no plan. I went to Target and Ulta and I am going to do a little haul because I spent a ridiculous amount of money for Wednesday night with no plan to spend any money. I would say normally haul videos don't do too well on my channel, but the last time I posted one, I had like 100 subscribers and now I have like just over 100 subscribers. So I think we should be fine. Like you guys should still watch this video. So I went <laughs> to Ulta and I went to Target and I bought stupid things at both of those places. So I will show you what I bought. I didn't buy that much at Ulta and I bought a lot at Target and that's normally how things go in my life. So, so first I guess I got the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I was actually planning on going to Target to buy foundation because I'm really pale, which really fucking sucks. But also that means nothing matches me and it makes me orange. And I get really insecure when my makeup is fucked up. I don't know what it is. Like I'd rather just not wear makeup than have fucked up makeup. So I'm gonna try this, see if it's my color, see if I like it. I know a lot of people like this. Did I say it was in the color snow? Because I'm pale as shit. No, yeah, okay. I'll put that over there. Up next, we have more makeup because apparently I was in a makeup mood. I have the Bare Minerals Matte Powder Foundation in the color Fair. Because again, I'm really pale. This is actually the lightest shade that they had. I think this might be too light for me. However, I figured I could just like bronze it up because I've been loving bronzer lately. And I also got the ColourPop No Filter Foundation or No Filter Concealer. And this actually felt like a really nice concealer. Um, it was a little thick and I swatched it really quick so I don't even know if it's gonna be my color, but I'm looking forward to using this. Am I supposed to put it close to the camera? Hold on. This, oh yes, Beauty Guru vibes. And this. And this. We're back. Uh, oh yes, okay. I also got this e.l.f. Beautifully Precise Powder Brush because normally when I do my makeup, I put like a light layer foundation or concealer. I'll just put concealer all over my face because somehow it's better than foundation. I don't know. Anyway, and then I'll use a setting powder, but I don't actually have a brush for the setting powder. So I bought this brush for that setting powder. So hopefully that goes well. Finally, look how stinking cute this is. Um, I bought this. Hot Tools Gold Rose Collection, uh, one and one quarter inch flipperless curling wand. Let's put this up here. Um, I have a curling wand from Hot Tools, but it's tapered. I really like it, but I wanted one that wasn't tapered and wanted that was like kind of big. And this one's kind of big, so I'm probably gonna curl my hair with this and see how it looks. Again, I was not planning on buying this, um, this was, how much was this? I don't even know. Uh, so it was originally $74.99 and I was gonna buy it. I knew it was that much. But then when I got up there, it was on sale and then I had a $2 coupon. So here we are living our best life. Okay, now we go to freaking Target. Y'all, I don't know what happened to Target. I just blacked out. I just got all the things I didn't need. I just bought all of them. So let me tell you what I went to Target for. I went to Target for these scent boosters um, 
because laundry. Mini pads, because biology's got me fucked up. Ah, body toner. I ended up finding this rose petal witch's hazel, which I think is the same thing. Here's the thing, I got on birth control and it really made my skin freak the fuck out. So I'm hoping this will help. If not, I don't know what to tell myself. I'm just gonna have to deal with gross skin. Mm, it smells good though. So I'm hoping to just like spray this on my back after the shower. I'm so cute, you guys are so lucky you have me. And I'm hoping that'll just like help things out. But, so that's all I went to Target for. And I still have a whole entire bag. So, get your watching pants on folks. We are, we're going for it. Uh, so to kind of play off of the witch's hazel, I got this grapefruit body wash. And I know that the grapefruit is supposed to be like not good for your skin because it's scented. But I'm gonna do it anyway, so. Makeup wipes because I don't know if I've told you I have this thing where I buy two of things. Like I have to have two of things. Like I always have to have at least two packs of makeup wipes and I always have to have at least two cans of um, dry shampoo because if I can't find one, I will literally go crazy. And I think that's like a problem, like a mental issue, but we're gonna ignore that and we're gonna pretend like it's normal. We have cookie dough because I have no craving control. Uh, razors, because I'm hairy. Eyebrow brush, e.l.f. beautifully precise. It's funny because I got one e.l.f. brush from Ulta and one e.l.f. brush from Target. So just this is what it looks like. I guess I probably should show all the things. Um, and then I got a face wash for my shower because I have like my sink face wash and then I have my shower face wash so I don't want to keep going back and forth. I've never tried this one. It's for acne prone skin and your girl is acne prone because apparently that's just like a thing for me now. Raspberries to counteract the cookie dough because that's how that works. Oh, here we are. A cute little eyebrow or freaking blending brush from Sonia Kashuk. I think this was like $6. Blending crease brush. I was actually looking for an eyeshadow palette um, at Ulta, but that wasn't, didn't happen for me. Probably a good thing. This Real Techniques um, foundation blending brush. Let me tell you a story. So, the Bare Minerals Powder Foundation that I have, I've been using that since literally I started wearing makeup, so like my freshman year of high school. I have the same exact powder brush that I've been using since my freshman year of high school. And it's a kabuki brush and it's very like dense and it like kind of makes my face itch. So I figured, like it wasn't even something that I thought about. I was like, Muh, I guess that's like a thing. I just like use it. Oops, I just rubbed that all over my dirty hand. Um, so I bought this one. I just got my oily face all over that. That's super cute. It looks like this. Um, and I hope it works. It's from Real Techniques, just like a little brush. I was a little worried because it's not circular. It's like an oval, but I figured it was time to replace the one that I've had since my freshman year of high school, which is eight years, by the way nine years 11 years actually i started high school in 2008 so 11 years ago um yeah that was time i don't even know how i didn't lose it that's really weird and then finally last but not least i got another one of these physician formula bronzers it's funny when i got this i did not care for it and then lately i've just been obsessed obsessed with it and I just hit pan on it and I'm like well it's another one of those things where I have to have two of and the other one is probably gonna break soon because I just hit pan so I figured why not why not just waste my money on this just kidding uh yeah but that was it for my haul and I want to say that I might return the Too Faced foundation but I can't guarantee anything. I didn't even let myself go near the clothing items in Target because I knew that sh shit was gonna be a disaster. Anyway, 
that's it for my haul if you guys liked this haul video i have a ton of other stuff that i could like haul also i'm planning on getting rid of like 95 percent of my makeup it's not like fancy pr makeup it's like trash makeup that i've had for 11 years since my freshman year of high school um so if you guys want to see a decluttering video of that let me know make sure you like make sure you subscribe and i will see you guys in my next freaking video bye